all right guys welcome back welcome to the channel we are playing the walking dead it's time for episode 3 episode 3 long road ahead and looks like we are out in the field we somehow managed to got a rail engine i guess so yeah, let's start this episode. Hope you guys enjoying this series so far. Make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel. And yeah, let's start this. Previously on The Walking Dead. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. No! <laughs> Sounds like a car. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. You're right. We shouldn't take this. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. All right, so that was what happened in the last episode. Alright, looks like they are in the city now. Episode 3, long road ahead. Looks like this is our lucky day. Maybe. Uh, maybe. They tend to take us by surprise. Yep. Yeah, well the less I see, the happier I am. Where do you come down on staying or going? You mean, packing up the motel and getting in the RV? Yeah, we've been talking about it, but have you made up your mind yet? We should stay, Kenny. We've made an all right go of it so far. Lee, you know that's bullshit. Those folks in the woods keep giving us hell. It's only a matter of time. We should get in the RV and get to the ocean. I need you with me on this, pal. Okay, just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <sighs> Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. No kidding. No shit. All right, let's just see what's here. There's no safe way through that mess. All right. What They're about blocked this? Blocked by all the fallen concrete. Can we climb this? Oh, it's it does not look safe. Let me just. Oh no. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another way up. Better get a move on. All right.
Let's try this. It's not gonna move. All right. Uh, what's that? Hmm. Looks like it still works. All right. We got something. Lily's not doing so good, huh? Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. All right, what's the deal now? Upset with me for taking stuff out of that car last week. What do you think? Christ, I've heard your opinion. What's done is done. <laughs> All right, time to climb. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm last night. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. What did he say? He just woke up in the middle of the night, screaming his head off. He thinks he killed Herschel's son. Oh, Christ. I'm sorry. Fact of the matter is, we did. You did, Kenny. It's not me. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, shit. oh man. What the hell happened? Thought you said you could handle it. God, you ever been shot before? I'm sorry. For Christ. You think you ah! Oh. Walkers don't scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. Oh no. It's a girl. We have to help her. How? There's no getting to her. We gotta do something. Come on, shoot it, please. Oh damn it. Come on. Fuck. We gotta shoot her. Put her out of this misery. You don't know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Can't think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Oh man, again with the moral choices. Alright. I'm shooting it. God damn it. <sighs> Well, that was my choice. Now look what you did. Let's move. Come on, let's move. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Dirty as hell, but we ain't got much time. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. All right, let's take everything. Oh, what's 
this. Nice, nice, nice. What else we are getting? Come on. Fuck! Incoming! Come on, Lee! Up and over. Push, push, push. Come on. Let's get it. Let's attack. Come on. Yes. Bridge. Nice one. Now, let's fucking get out. Come on. Let's move. Let's move. Please. One more, one more. Nice one. Come on, one more. Let me one more. Oh my god. Come on, don't come here. Nice kill. Nice hit. Move, move. Damn it. Move. Let's go, pal. Yep, time to leave. back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? Just what was left. Maybe could have got more. Half of it's probably expired. It just wasn't a lot left. This it? Yeah, well, we've been picking Macon clean for weeks. <sighs> Fuck. Which is why I've been saying, and I don't want to sound like a broken record here, but we gotta hit the road. He's piling into an RV with you two after what you did to my dad is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. That's not graffiti. Those are bullet holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking out of it to dry our laundry. We do whatever is best for the kids. Doesn't that make sense? It's suicide out there. We'll die in here. You're right. You could see someone sleeping and kill one of us. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. And don't start with me, either. It could be so much worse. When's the last time someone got bitten? Are you counting the St. John's? Jesus, Ben. We're all going a little nuts. But we can't tear each other apart. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you... We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always do. And when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? What then? You just gonna deal with that? Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. We wouldn't even be fighting about our medicine and supply stocks if Lee hadn't fucked up downtown. What do you mean? 
Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She was making enough noise that we would have had plenty of time to get what we needed. Instead, smart guy shot her. He what? He put her out of her misery. Stupid. Instead of what? Letting her suffer? I couldn't let her suffer. We're all suffering. Some more than others. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Y'all should be giving Lee hell for not doing what needed to be done. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right, stealing. And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. Now everybody get out. Damn, she's pissed. Happy Kenny. Happy Kenny. My family's alive and that RV is running. You goddamn right I am. Everyone is under great stress. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Oh, things are coming to a head. You could say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. All right. <laughs>